Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No, why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. Need help with those veggies? I learned a long time ago, you're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it. Pete, glad to see you're okay. Hmm, this office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. Voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. Lee's journal. A key. Wonder where the lock is. Sounds conflicted. Almost like he didn't want to head down this path. Looks like this note is for May. Lee really did care about May. Hope this means she's out of danger. Huh. The shrine in the photo is missing the picture. Puzzle lock. That seems right. Older MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Phew. 
It's a burn room. Wired to destroy evidence. One more. Police had found this. Or May. I don't want to think of what could have happened. This is all about Norman Osborne. His whole career. Lee must have been obsessed with. Okay, through the floor grate. Lee's giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? Lee sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon, until he became one. Now, how do I get out of here? Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. I can get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is, you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. Wait, wait! Captain Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named May Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey, just checking in. Hey, Pete. So this station monitors water pressure down to the individual building. Structures above four stories use water towers to augment the city's system. The idea is to identify problems before they spread, you know? Whoa. The pressure in this building's all over the map. I need to find out why. The water towers connect to the city's system at the four-story mark. 
I'll scan the pipes, try to see where this starts. Pipes are fine up here. Whatever's causing this, it's lower. Here's the problem. Valve's at the wrong setting. Easy enough to fix. That shouldn't have happened. I better seal these fast before Jameson pins it on me. Amazing spider plumber. Better than duct tape. Got it. Just in time. one but those won't hold long pressure shouldn't be that high unless the drainage is blocked i'll check the outlet pipe the outlet pipes down by the waterfront i'll go see if anything's blocking it yeah. now i ask how many other heroes fight crime and fix your shower and now Oscorp can't deny Harry Station stopped a public utility meltdown. Hey Yuri, I'm going to keep checking into Devil's Breath. Need to find out why Lee wants it. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APD. MJ, hey, just checking in. Peter, hey, can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait, remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? <sighs> what should I cook? Hey pal, this station tests particulate matter in the air. Now, you'd probably have some science jargony way to say this, but basically, too much is not good. Hmm, readings are troubling but inconsistent. The only way I'll figure out what's going on is to test nearby emissions. But I've got other problems. The sampler's detecting toxic particles. Better check it out. That steam vent's a good place to start.
There's something in here that doesn't belong. Let's analyze it. Mercury. Bonded with... something else. I can't tell what. This obviously isn't confined to one building. A lot of people are at risk. See what a sample from this can tell me. Nitric acid in there, too, but also something else. I'm on the right track. Just need to keep following the trail. This is more widespread than I thought. The whole neighborhood's in danger from this. Phew. That stinks to high heaven. Time to find out what's in it. Ethanol. Why is this sounding so familiar? Mercury with nitrogen and ethanol. Gotta get back on the trail. When this is over, I'll alert the health department so they can check on the local residents. I think I found the problem. Caustic chemicals are leaking out of those barrels and into the plumbing. Need to clean up the site fast. Huh. The calcium and silicon and concrete makes it an ideal absorption material. Looks like I'll have to make a mess to fix this mess. One down. Nice, it's working. <coughs> Just a couple more barrels. Last one. <laughs> Gotta stay above this stuff. <coughs> That's it! Sealing the grate with webbing should stop any residual drainage. That could have been way worse. Harry's research station just proved why it needs to stay open. Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Hey, Doc. Sorry about that. What's up? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like, now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Uh, be right there. Wonder if this means I have a job again. 
Guess I can stop by just for a minute. job, Mr. Mayor. All I have is my integrity, and I won't compromise it for anyone. Now, what's this crucial breaking news you're revealing for the first time anywhere on my show? Well, after the brutal, cowardly city hall bombing that almost claimed my life, it's clear our understaffed police department needs help. And I want to reassure the people of New York that I am providing Aha! I said it! You all heard me say we needed this. Are you using my idea of bringing in cops from Lake Placid? Ah, no. So that was a fine idea. No, it would be a security contractor, much like the ones our military uses to assist our troops overseas. I can't name it until the contracts are signed, but their qualifications are impeccable. Well, that sounds terrific, Mr. Mayor. Though, of course, I'll have to reserve my tough but fair final judgment until I have all the facts. I'd expect nothing less. And let me stress, this is in no way replacing our brave officers of the law, just augmenting them in a way that cuts through the red tape and gets results. And results are what we want. You know, I'm glad you're here, so I can share my theory on how Spider-Man may well be working with the demons. And a fascinating theory it is, I'm sure. But my doctors are advising me to get some rest now, so if you don't mind. Oh, of course. Thank you for calling in, Mr. Mayor. My lines are open for you anytime. Jared, did you hear? Tough, but fair! That's our new slogan. I don't care who else is using it! Don't care! 